Hi friends, welcome back to the Guitar Spa where we bring you all the beautiful guitars. Oh, ho, 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 review just for you and this is Jarvis. And um, I just have a confession to make, a real embarrassing confession. Oh, I mean, I have a love affair. And I have a love affair with three brands, the Holy Trinity, the Gibson, the Martin, and the Taylor. They call it the Holy Trinity of guitars. <laughs> I got you. The Holy Trinity of uh, guitars uh, in the music, in the guitar world. You have the Gibson, you got the Martin, and the Taylor. And I have it all here. And, and, and in this very corner of this, I have three guitars here. And I'm going to do a... Uh, a uh, shootout or let's say comparison just a visual not just visual I will say just an audio where I play uh, three of these guitars one is a J45 and one is a D18 and one is the new V class 517E uh, all of them have mahogany back and sides and spruce stop um, generally they are all two slope shoulders well j45 is a slope shoulder the uh tailor is a uh modified modern looking modern take of what a slope shoulder is and the martin is a dreadnought so um here we go this is the uh, j45 and then the d18 and then later i'll show you the um the um tailor 517 and now what I'm gonna do is just play some strumming on the first fret um, maybe two types of uh, playing on the on the first fret position and then a little bit on the upper register and then couple and then finger style okay it's gonna take a little while but just be patient with me because uh, it's very rare where I get all those three lovely brands Gibson the Martin and the Taylor to be here. They call it the Holy Trinity of guitars. Uh, and, and really, it's an excitement. And I hope you guys out there are as excited uh, with that love affair with these three brands. Okay, it, I call it a love affair, a, 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 a positive love affair. Okay. Okay, the J45. relatively warm sounding
right, the J45, the J45 here, J45 Gibson. Beautiful J45 uh, Gibson. I'll just show you. Here says, the banner says, only a Gibson is good enough for you. I don't know whether it's good enough for you, but you be the judge. Um, and right now, the legendary D18 Martin Guitars. We have um, lots of history with the Martin Guitars. And I think the best the best time to live right now is, is now because guitars are getting better and better um, um, with new technology, new aging technology, new... Um, processes that that are improving even the plaque where where the um, the frets are level correctly in CNC machines oh man this is the the best time to live your life when it comes to uh, music all right the Martin the 18 Something about Martin is um, and start is not that bright, but uh, the more you play, uh, it's very soothing to your to your to your ears. That's uh, something I will say. A uh, description of the uh, Martin guitars. Same with the Gibsons. Uh, the Taylor is different. The different feel. Everything. So every guitar that you play, I mean, uh, I guess you would also have that different ex uh, expression. The way even you the way you hold the pick and to get the sound out. To uh, produce the, the 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 timber, the tone, and stuff like that. Uh, but the other thing is the every time you play a different guitar, um, the the feeling I would say the emotional feeling is slightly different, um, uh, even though it could be the same song. <laughs> I'm using the uh, Martin uh, Orange 0 0.60 pick on on uh, on playing all these guitars. Okay.
I'm just trying to keep it as uh, short, sharp, so and also play the same punches on uh, the all the three guitars. And the next one is the Taylor. So we had the Gibson, the Gibson, or the Gibson, Gibson in Thailand they call it Gibson, or in in Indonesia they call it the Gibson, the Gibson, the Martin. And then right now we're gonna have in Thai they call it the Taylor, Taylor five one seven Sika screw stop with the mahogany mahogany back and sides and um these are available through sweetie music the gibsons are also available through city music and the martin is available through no the gibson is the taylor sweetie gibson is from sweetie and the martin is from city music okay this is what happens when you have a love affair with three different guitars Sounding guitar uh, that is on very tailorish. People call it a tailorish. When they say tailorish, means it's bright. Okay, this this sounds tailorish. That means it's bright. Okay, it sounds really Martin. Okay, then it's warm and and it says very Gibson. They, they don't say Gibson Gibsonish. No, I never heard that. Just say very Gibson. Country, your country. Okay. Play the second song, let it go, okay, right now, do a little bit carried away, okay.
right, all right. Give me a comment right now. Give me a thumbs up right now. The video. I just wanna before I put this back on the stand. Give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Come on. Thumbs up for Jarvis. Thumbs up for the Mark Gibson. Thumbs up for the Taylor. And thumbs up for the Martin. Okay. Thumbs up for this show because um, life is all about giving people thumbs up. Okay. If you're down, please come on. Thumbs up. Get going. Get going. Push. Push. Go. 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 I mean, that's how you encourage people in life, right? I mean. When the going get tough, the tough get going. It's time to encourage your fellow humans, fellow guitarists. I know right now it's a tough time with the global uh, COVID virus thing where you as musicians and you, um, uh, what can I say? I mean, we are all locked down. We are all at home. So the opportunity for you right now is reconnect yourself with your music. Reconnect yourself with your maker and and ask for help. You know, I mean, uh, and I know it's easy to say, but uh, it's not. This whole thing is affecting from the top all the way down to the bottom. Okay, and and also I think uh, in tough times like this, uh, this is the opportunity where you reconnect with people you love. I think that's the most one of the most important core values is connecting with people that are close to you, close to your heart. And people you love, your mom, your dad, your family members. You know, uh, right now, uh, mom and dad don't have to tell their children to come back early because they are, are there by default, you know, because uh, most of the clubs are all closed, even in Europe, uh, maybe in, in the States. And and um, and also, you may be always having meals with people, your friends, and this time you are in your family and you have to have uh, those meals with your um your loved ones and sometimes uh the closest people are the uh, are the ones that is difficult to have a close conversation because you get agitated a little bit you get you know, uh, the way the tonality of how you speak to the people that are closest to you is because we take them for granted okay and when we are friends we're very cordial we are very um polite in uh, what to say it. so maybe when you're back right home right now with those people, I mean, your family members, your friends, your wife, your spouse, um, and some of like these people that you really cannot stand is to just pull back a little bit, listen, ask questions, how's your day, what happened at work, uh, what type of movie you like at Netflix, start a conversation, and maybe, you know, you have some tunes, you have a composition, you said, hey, you know, I have this composition, what do you think? Um, and 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 um, start a conversation. You'll be surprised. And um, if that happens, and a positive uh, rolling start rolling, rolling rolling in the river. So when you start rolling, you know, please just comment below and, and about your experience. And I believe it's gonna be positive. Uh, it may it may not start positive, but it will be positive. Okay. So enough of that. J forty five. I just do a bit of finger picking first.
I would describe the Gibson tone will be a little bit of the quite the dirty tone, the dirty. The when they say dirty means it's not very clean. I mean it's not very clear. It's a dirty tone. They have got that dirty tone. So if you like the dirty tone, it's because this is the only short skill, short skill guitar among the three of them. So it has that warmness that right now you can actually, <laughs> evidently right now as you hear, as you hear you rewind a little bit back track a little bit you would hear that it is it has a dirty tone uh the martin will have a dirty tone after many years because uh, as you grow older you become a little bit dirty <laughs> no that's just fun intended okay uh, just just a joke okay i'm just not please don't get offended come on don't throw stones on me come on throw stones the stones will not hit me because i you know okay so oh, man, oh man, oh man. So the Martin D18, D18, um, something about the D18, uh, if you notice, um, quite a number of artists um, um, got, have interviews with uh, guitar markets, acoustic guitar magazine. And it's interesting to, to note that um, a lot of them have an, an old D18. Uh, though they may not play it live and things like that, but it goes to show it it just tells you something a statement about what the special attributes of uh, tonally of a d18 has you know um woody and and i think it's something magical so uh, it's for you to just <coughs> contemplate and reflect on okay Something you note uh, if you watch a lot of my videos that even though some of the guitars I play the same tune, the way I express it's it's very different because I'm having a relationship, uh, a communication relationship with that guitar. Um, that's why I say love affair. It's the expression I have on the guitar and how the guitar expresses it back musically um, and then it's like back and forth. It's like having a conversation. I stroke my fingers and the guitar responses back and I, I stroke it in a different way and then the, the tone comes back to you that's the the something that is a mysterious that um, mystical that I can't explain okay okay so I'm just just being frank with you and this is basically like a living room where um, I be frank you know about what I do and stuff like that
put poppy a little bit because there was slightly muting, slightly muting. got a bit carried away on this D18 Martin that's why I said you know um, this love affair with this all those guitars is um, do you they are all they all have special uh, good attributes just like um, I believe the good of every person um, um, and every person uh, exhibits different positive attributes just like guitars and um, we need to I won't use the word tackle but we need to there's no one uh, style apply all I mean not style but um, the way you relate to the guitar uh, needs to be adjusted to bring out the best of, of, of the tone um, the playability the way you, you, you express yourself so um, relating with individual brands models gibson taylor martin uh, or maybe when you play a little martin or a baby taylor or gibson um just a mini j200 um the way you stroke it the way you strum it it's a little bit different it it, it all depends on how um you respond okay so uh that's about guitars uh to sing. Okay, so that's just uh on this is really fantastic as what they say Taylor has a, probably one of the best uh, playability playability among these three guitars uh, don't ask me why maybe the neck or the way it's done
All right, enough, enough. Uh, you've done is uh, the tree, holy trinity. I've said before. I have, I have a confession, and I have the confession is that the I have a love affair with the holy trinity of guitars, uh, the Gibson. This is just here. The Martin. And the Taylor just now, which I showed is too far ahead. I don't want to just bring it up. And um, please uh, comment below uh, what do you think. I know um, it's very hard, you know, to to uh, love all this tree because all this tree they are they all have special attributes um, 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 in them. It's like ice cream. You can't say the strawberry is better than the chocolate, and the chocolate is better tasting than the vanilla. But um, and obviously, if you have the money, I would suggest, uh, I would strongly suggest to at least own one of this each brand in your stable because uh, they 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 uh, they tend to uh, do certain things emotionally. I mean that emotional response. I like what talk about that response when you have uh, when you play with any of these three brands. It's I know some people said, hey, the, you know this guitar the 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 uh, workmanship is is different from that and um and um it's like a pair of jeans or a, a t-shirt you know i have a lot of black t-shirt and and different brands and uh, some i wear when i sleep and some i wear when i go up uh, uh, they they all serve different function you know some are worn out a bit but i like the worn out when i'm sleeping because it's soft um and then for those who are, it's a little bit tight to accentuate my body if I have a body. Uh, that's something I like also. Um, um, so so it's different uh, strokes for different folks. So if you like this review, give me a thumbs up. What do you think? Uh, incidentally, the Gibsons and the Taylor are available through Sweetie Music. And the Martin is from, no, sorry. The Gibsons and Taylor are from Sweetie Music. And the Martin are from City Music. Okay, this is just getting my my mind is just jumbled up. This love affair is really affecting me uh, mentally. So, uh, give me a thumbs up. Share this to social media because this is the first Gibson Taylor Martin uh, shootout comparison I'm doing in this channel. And and really, it's an honor uh, for you to stay tuned till my next review. Because I live with passion, play a guitar, I love joy, peace, health and wealth to be multiplied in your life. I'll see you very soon. This is Javis signing off. Bye-bye. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye.